I'm Adam Kujawa, Director of Malware Intelligence for Malwarebytes Labs, and I really want you to check out the newest creation from Malwarebytes Labs. We call it the Cybercrime Tactics and Techniques Report. This report is going to cover some of the most relevant observations and findings paired with predictions of what we might see directly from the minds of Malwarebytes Labs. We're going to be releasing a new one every quarter, so keep an eye out. As a sneak peek into what you will read about in the report, here are a few highlights you might find interesting. First of all, ransomware dominated in 2016 and will continue to do so in 2017. We expect to see very little variation in this, and if anything, it's going to get worse. In non-ransomware related news, the Kofor Trojan exhibiting ad fraud behavior as the most prevalent non-ransomware Windows malware family observed, not only near the end of 2016, but throughout most of the year. Phishing and mouse spammer attacks are getting more sophisticated from delivering new types of payloads to defeating automated analysis systems with the use of password protected documents and zip files. Speaking of Windows malware and distribution, after the fall of Angular in mid-2016, Rig Exploit Kit took the reins as the predominant exploit kit observed being used in the wild. Though it's not the only one out there, it's the one we've seen a lot of. We've also seen things like Sundown and Neutrino. As far as the Mac threat landscape goes, it consists primarily of adware and pups. However, Macs did experience its first example of ransomware, as well as a slew of different Trojan droppers, pushing tech support scams, adware installs, and even in some cases, backdoor malware. Finally, we've observed an increase in the sophistication and cross-development of all kinds of scams, from pups to tech support scammers. We expect 2017 to be a big year for seeing some seriously heinous scams targeting folks who just aren't aware of the threats. That's why it's so important to spread this knowledge. As mentioned before, we plan on releasing this kind of report every quarter from now on, and you can always find it on Malwarebytes Labs. We hope you enjoyed the read and have learned some new things. I'm Adam Kujawa for Malwarebytes Labs. If you want to read the report, click the link below. Also, please subscribe for more videos like this. Thanks for reading and watching. Safe surfing, and I'll catch you next time.